Good morning, fellow billionaires. This is Silver5150 with your morning update for Friday, June the 19th, 2020. I want to give you guys a special thanks for the outpouring and great comments and compliments last night after last night's show, where I basically spilled the beans on some really radical, crazy things I've been doing um, with Silver lately. And I appreciate you guys just kind of holding your nose a little bit and you're shaking your heads, but you're very supportive and, um, and uh, kind of cringing a little bit. And I get it. I get it. You know, the things I do um, um, really can't be wrapped in rationality. But, you know, I can tell you that a lot of good, great new opportunities came from uh, that move that I made when I sold some silver. However, um, that has reduced my stack quite a bit. So now I'm completely within range of all the aggressive stackers out there, and you know who you are. So come get me. <laughs> I'm going to be stacking right with you, but I'm, I am picking up more um, interesting pieces uh, as a result, like this Monarch 1-ounce poured bar, which I think is very cool. Um, and it's, you know, nothing special. Uh, it's just uh, it's got a stamp on the front, and it's very um, basic on the back. And uh, But it's 1-ounce, and it is a very well poured uh, poured bar. All right. Um, yeah, and you know, when I think about it now, this bar here, it probably represents me better than most pieces. Um, you know, a lot, of, a lot of flash and flare, you know, on the surface and out front, but, you know, inside, just, you know, a regular person. No big deal. Um, but I do appreciate, you know, finding a place and finding a space in my new silver stacking family. You guys are great. All right, before I get too sappy, let's go to the markets. <laughs> Markets today, we finally got some normalcy um, in the indexes. So we've got the dollar down just above the 97 handle, which means it's 97.16 basis points, um, which is down quite a bit from when it was up to almost 101 here earlier in the year. And so with that little bit of dollar weakness comes, of course, assets valued in dollars are going to be up pretty good. And so uh, as a result, uh, stock futures are up anywhere from 1% to 2% across the board. And it looks like they're going to put on some pretty healthy gains today. Now, I don't know if that's from dollar weakness or stimulus hopes, you know, uh, as things uh, didn't look too good in the job, uh, jobless claims yesterday. That means that the Fed is going to be compelled to step in and start stimulus sooner or, hang on, or, um, you know, maybe uh, you know, maybe things uh, are picking up. Maybe things are improving, and the dollar is going down as a result. We'll see um, as the weeks develop. But um, yeah, right now silver is up about two percent to seventeen dollars um, and eighty eighty five cents, I think. And then um, gold is up about one percent to seventeen forty five. So gold put on quite a bit um, from the seventeen thirty level. Silver's up, like I said, about two percent. And so, if you're going to go after some of those deals today, just be aware. Just be aware of that. That you know, silver's packed on about thirty five forty cents, and that's going to be reflected in those deal prices. Uh, speaking of deals, special shout out to subscriber Sin, who in the wee hours of the morning posted um, really good deal on Maple Leafs and American Silver Eagles at Provident. Right now, any quantity price, cash price for Eagles is around twenty two seventy five, and for the Maples, it's about twenty one seventy five. Okay, um, nice and short and sweet this morning, but uh, I want to tell you guys to go ahead and keep up your cellular immunity, all right, and get ready for the weekend, have some fun. Um, on that note, I have a, a nice little, uh, a fun story for you guys tonight. It's going to be uh, a future um, excursion with the Secret Silver Society members. Uh, this will be some new members and some key members and stuff, and uh, and they're going to run up uh, to the Arctic and um, have a uh, daring rescue take place there. So please join us tonight for that. Um, and on another programming note, I told you guys last night that I'm going to be gone for the uh, following week. Uh, today will be my last broadcast. Um, tonight will be my last broadcast. And then the following week up until the 29th, I'll be off the air. Um, I will be in the comments uh, below, you know, and uh, I might indulge in a couple of emails. But um, other than that, I will be um, offline um, for podcast. So keep that in mind, but have a great day. Um, get ready for the adventure tonight. We will see you then and, um, we will, uh, work our way into the weekend. All right, guys, have a great day. Thanks for tuning in last night. Thank you for the outpouring of love and support. Appreciate you guys and, uh, take care.